What's good, YouTube? Today, from react to Rona Hannafin. Um, he's a four star athlete, 6'3, 208 pounds, I guess. And we finna see what he got, bro. He, just, he committed to Clemson like, I think, two days ago. I should have been reacting to him, but I'm just now getting to it. I ain't gonna lie, I kind of fuck with the vibe of what it's like, what they playing at. I ain't gonna lie, it's kind of, kind of, oh my god. Oh, nah. Run that back. Just, bro, just watch him. He just catch the ball and he going like that. Give it to me. Oh, I'm gone. Bro, nah. Hey, he stupid fast. He's 6'3". Remember that. Nah, bro. I should have timed how fast that was. Like, how many seconds it took. What the fuck? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> nah. I'm still stuck on the first run, bro. How he just caught that hole and just dipped. Hmm, come here, boy. What you think this is? And then looked at him. Yeah, yeah. Drop him. And he said, he, "Ooh, just drove him on his back." He said he on his George Pickens. Hey, y'all been seeing George Pickens go crazy in the preseason and in practice. Oh, I didn't even see what really happened right there. I was looking at the wrong dude. I was looking at the wrong dude. I was looking at him right here. Recovery speed. <laughs> Give me that. And the dude was bigger than him, too. Came and took it from him. That's crazy. I wonder how tall that dude, that, that tight end was, bro. Because if he's 6'3", that dude got to be like 6'5", 6 6'6". 6 6. And um, he's the top. He's a top five player out of Massachusetts. So, hey, he liked that where he from. He's he's one of them boys where he from. Upstate. Well, upstates. I ain't gonna say upstate because he could be downstate in Massachusetts. But he upstates, you know. <laughs> Bro, look at the speed. He went and caught the cornerback. He just threw it up. Why not? Why not? Why not just throw it up? He's 6'3". The cornerback look about 5'10", maybe 5'9". Why not do that? And on defense, he looking like he just hit everything. But from the looks of it, of what I'm seeing, I would rather have him on offense. Not even going to lie. Because his speed is crazy. But on defense, too, that speed, you know, like... I don't know, man. He's going to Clemson, so... Maybe I could see him as a linebacker at Clemson. I'm not going to lie. Maybe I could see him as a linebacker on Clemson. But I wouldn't be mad at a receiver either, though, because, like, he got the speed. But we ain't really seen, like, a lot of crazy routes. So that might be the thing. Like, he would probably have to work on his route running and stuff like that. But his speed-wise, he got all that. Height, got that. Weight, got that. Like, <laughs> what else you do you need him to do for real? So yeah, defense may be the um position. I would I would probably say that. Yeah, if y'all know anything about him, let me know what position he's gonna play in college. Let me know like what they really recruiting him as. But he look like he on either side of the ball, he's gonna give it his all. You see how he's blocking out here. Everybody not blocking like that. Dude, look at oh my god. <laughs> yeah, we gotta end it there. We're gonna end it right there. Perfect way to end it. Perfect way. I'm glad I got to watch him, bro, because I almost didn't watch him, you know what I mean? Because I feel like it was starting to get late. I should have watched him yesterday, but I'm glad I ended up watching him for real, you know what I mean? Because it was worth the watch, 6'3", 210 pounds, and he's really fast. I wish I knew his 40 or at least his 100. Uh, also plays lacrosse. <laughs> I, ain't never seen a, I ain't never seen a player like, I ain't never seen this. Like, I ain't never seen a player play football and lacrosse. I'm pretty sure that that's common probably, but I'm just saying I never seen another like another ranked player do that. Three phase player with significant snaps at receiver, multiple spots on defense, and in the return game. See, just doing everything for his team. I feel it. This is a big pickup for Clemson. Um Clemson had a huge month. I think it was June and at the beginning of July. I don't re really remember how they've been the last few weeks, but they was pretty hot, but 
this is a really good pickup. They got some demons on this team, bro. Don't sleep on um, Clemson class, for real. Do not sleep on this class. Like, Christopher is tough. Like, they, they just got back-to-back five-star quarterbacks. Think about that. Back-to-back five-star quarterbacks. I don't know if they got one in 2021. Did they get one in 2021? I know they got in 2020. They got, they got DJ in 2020. And then they got, last year they got Cade. And then this year, well, possibly this year, they finna get Christopher. So, hey, Clemson, they getting them quarterbacks, man. So, hey, they doing right with that position. They ain't really got no receivers in this class. Oh, they got Nova Johnson. Oh, I forgot they got him. Oh, yeah, then never mind. They got a receiver. All right. Running back. I don't really see no running back right now. Yeah, I don't see no running back on here unless this dude play running back. I don't know. I haven't reacted to him or nothing, but he's an athlete. And this dude, he probably going to play receiver or maybe linebacker. But, yeah, this is a, still a good class, you know, like, especially on defense. Jamal Anderson, tough. Bro is like a mini. Well, I ain't going to say a mini. Bro is basically Isaiah Simmons 2.0 in my opinion. I'm not saying he's going to be as good, but you can see the comparison. You see the potential in him. They got Avion Terrell, too. Like, defensive players in this class is tough, bro. Legit dudes. But that's going to be it for the video. Let me know what y'all think of Rona, and I'm going to catch y'all next time.